Hello, High School Africa. Alright, uh, so now next we have Don Poissy Senior High School. Africa. As the president of the Student Representative Council, SRC, I speak on behalf of the students, the prefects, the staff, and the board of directors of the school to draw your attention to the probable condition of Dumpa Senior High School and what I and my court prefect will do to cause a change when the 10,000 Ghana city is given to us. Dumpa Senior High School was established in the year 1964. Since its establishment, it has not received the deserved attention and development, although some of its needs have been honored. The only source of support in terms of physical infrastructure has been the Parent and Teachers Association. It is on this note that I, Benjamin Apia, together with my coach prefect, have come to a honorable place to seek for the prize in order to commence the project. Our school believes in hard work, efficiency, and productivity. With regard to this belief, we the student leaders have decided to use the 10,000 cities when given to us to invest in the visual art department in our school. This initiative is taken by I and my hardworking prefect because the visual art department in my school likes so many things which if they have access to, it is going to serve the entire school. This visual arts program was introduced in 2019 by the then headmaster Dr. Jabin with the aim to help students to acquire skills to produce items which will benefit both the producer and the consumer. Again, to help them establish for themselves a business unit or an enterprise with a little narrow account, even if they do not further the education or could not continue to the tertiary level. They started the program with four students, in which there were males and a female who happens to be the headmaster's daughter. The various programs introduced were general knowledge in art, graphic design, leather work, in addition to the four subjects. Right now, I'm at visual arts department, so let's get inside and see how the place really looks like. As you can see, there are no chairs in the studio. This is as a result of the increasing number of students. The chairs in the studio has been sent to other classrooms to be used by other students. Sometimes, this studio is used by the students as their classrooms because of inadequate facilities and classroom in this institution. Table. That's padded table because they have no access to proper tables for their works. Look at the kind of tables they are used in doing their works. This is going to make their works look very unpleasant because of how rough the table is. And also, they lack looms. Now, a loom is the most important thing when it comes in terms of weaving. In this case, they can print clothes and other materials when they get access to them. This studio also like computers and printers. 
which will help them in their graphic design. If they get access to this, they will do their design on the computers and then print it to enhance their project works. Again, some of the tools they lack are projector, lockers, mallet, carving tools, potter's wheel, developing boards, looms, and many more. Although the number of students keep on increasing, the teachers manage to use their scanty resources over there. Though they like tools and equipment, but see what they can make with the little things they have. This means when these students are giving the maximum support, they are going to awesomely do the best. Isn't this incredible? Please help us support this project to make something amazing out of these students. Some of these benefits we will gain after aiding these young ones are first, it will pave way for the student to design new outfits for the school employees. Secondly, when any department or an organization needs a shirt to be different from the other department, they will do so, which will come at a lower rate. And also, they can also make locally made products like footwear, bags, leather watches, pottery to hail the name of the school high. And also, they can make copies of school uniforms when they are scarce. So as you can see in this video, something which was supposed to be done on a clean and smooth table is now being done on the ground. Even though they have no access to the necessary tools and equipment, but see what they can do with the little things they have. So this means that when they are giving the maximum support, they are going to do more than that. Our school in particular believes in one thing, and that is invest in their people today and grab their profit in the near future. Thank you.
So maybe the MP. <laughs> then, sorry, I, they, they, are are all, they are all honorable. Mm. Three names. Hard honorable. The video editors, yes. Yeah. Maybe from the ICT department. Mm. Okay. Or, um. <laughs> like that's how you call the. Uh, maybe. Uh, mm -hmm. um. I don't know if no. I don't know if I'm the only one, but I feel first of all I love the things at the time that I know the mm. visual arts. It's something I would even personally something I would love to even help or assist. Yeah. But specifically what are you asking for me? I see them only placing emphasis on table. Helping them with table. And I, I Did don't, you I don't not get mention it. equipment? Really? I didn't hear I that. Didn't hear that. It was, uh, initially, I think he said he want, they wanted to. Um, let's look at before we enter the department. Uh, they said they need so many things or something. Yeah. So, yeah. It's not only the table, I think. Yeah. Uh, table is one. Visual as if you want to do a lot of things, practical things, yeah. they need very wide tables. But apart from that, maybe other things that post. So the thing. whole place is empty. Mm. The, mm. the department, the room is empty. So they need everything from table, chair, machines, everything that will help them mm -hmm. acquire the needed skills in that department as students. And I don't know if the 10,000 will be enough yeah. to do that. Um, well, uh, I look at it as a, it's a project that can generate fun. Like all this, these things like the will be sold. So there is sustainability. And I think he said something like they could make all these things and then it will bring a uh, fun and other things. So if they could start by making these white tables and then maybe the shelves around the wall where they can put smaller items for projects and uh, few materials. You can see they are already creating their own stencil and mm -hmm. other things from, uh, uh, how would I put it, um, improvised materials. Sure. Uh -huh. So they could start with the improvisation, they have the tables and those things. And if you get money, then they add machinery. But this one, I think it is purely by the amount of power. Mm -hmm. They were creating the screens and those things. And you see, they were doing using um, just natural resources to do that so what i'm also thinking is why haven't they started something already if uh -huh. indeed this is fetching them and, or and this will fetch them looks, money uh, as if it's abandoned they've not been using yes. this place i don't know whether some mm. of these videos they are exaggerating or that is the real situation mm. on the ground i think we need to uh, make a follow-up Yes, because this one like this. Whoever wins, there should be a. If they are doing all this practical work on the ground, yeah, why, why can't started? you go inside the room there and do the work on the floor for us to see, and then you are doing it outside? Yeah. Why but, haven't they been started something this, already? This Maybe. is a, a presentation, so I think it's it goes beyond because if you give me, you are making me think because visual arts department needs a lot of things. I should think and. Mention for myself a lot of other things. That's why I mentioned table because these and I, that happened to be the only specific thing that was mentioned. Because you're using the money, so you need to account for every money that goes out. So you've mentioned table, but equipment-wise, maybe you need um, uh, is it some of these technical stuff specifically. And you need, this, for, you need for, this. for batik then, making, I think they will need wax and uh, rapiers and all those things, but. From the lookout of things, it seems they are, according to him, without these tables and things, they are still working. So I think his focus is on the big tables. The big tables are technical um, equipment that you need to have. You can't use ordinary tables. Mm -hmm. Some are round and mm -hmm. the, some are over at the middle. Then we have some made around the wall for uh, smaller things to be done. But, hmm. It's my worry is what Madame said, the room. Mm. It, it looks like it's abandoned. Yes. So was there equipment then? How come it became like this? Yeah, because yeah, he was he said there's no yeah. chair, but yeah. I didn't think the issue was no chair. There's I see stuff spots over there. Yeah, so if, if you couldn't manage it then after this fund, what happens? Yeah. 
And if they are doing all this work and they couldn't even get anything later to start something, or to even fix that small, it's quite um, worrying. Switch, switch, yeah. switch over that the whole. Ah. I'm like, no. Uh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> wow.